Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to the channel. Dimes T here, aka Glitch Guru. In today's GTA 5 online video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can create your very own modded car solo. Alright, so I'm going to be showing you guys a Benny's Merge glitch solo that came out recently. I believe the founder of this glitch is Brown Tango, so shout out to Brown Tango for that. Uh, the very first thing that you guys want to do is make sure that you do have a modded car. If you don't have a modded car at all, then you guys could probably use one of those Benny's Originals vehicles that has some wheels. Put some wheels on it that you like and then have that transferred to the car that you want to put it on. It won't have the paint or the tinted windows or the yanking, but you will have wheels. So what you want to do first, guys, is drive the modded car that you want to transfer the mods onto another car that's not modded into your workshop. Once you do that, you want to go over to your RC. Now go into first person and get to the very edge of the RC like this. If you were to press up on it just a little bit, that notification would disappear. Now what you guys want to do is just hit up on the left analog stick, right on the D-pad, and X or A if you're on Xbox, all at the same exact time. Your camera should spin like that. You should not get sucked into the menu. If you hit that correctly, then you guys just want to get back into your vehicle. If you didn't hit that correctly, then you guys just want to keep trying it over until you get that. All right, but if you hit it, Get back into your vehicle, change one thing on the vehicle. So I'm just going to go ahead and change the armor. Very easy. After that, I'm going to press options, go down to cruise. And from there, I'm going to go to the leaderboard. And we're going to select IGN crew. Select view members. And we're going to join one of the members on this list. If you fail to get the session details of the first person you join, just press OK to that alert and then join another person. But that didn't happen to me. So it kicked me off of that first alert. And we're going to get a second alert here. Once we get the second alert, guys, we're just going to stay on it for five seconds. Okay, so that first alert that I got after I joined, I got the session details. It kicks you off of that alert automatically. You'll wait. You'll get a second alert. You just want to wait on that one for five seconds and then press circle to back out. Now we're going to hop into the car that we want to put all of the modifications on, which is this stock vehicle right here. Pretty much stock. It does not have any bennies on it. It's not modded in any type of way. So just make sure that you do have the modded car inside of your arena, plus the car that you want to mod, and you just want to drive it outside. All right, just hit the gas, boom. Once you drive it outside, the car will change. You will see all the modifications on it. We now have the 3D modded paint job. We now have the bennies, rims, and there go my boy Faze L dude out here with his joint, you know what I mean? Just stunting on that by, you know what I'm saying? Just, you know, bowling. You know, you got a lot of cars out here now, man. Make sure you guys go check out his channel as well because he does do videos of GTA as well over there, Phase L do. All right, but if you want to save the vehicle, guys, you just want to hop out of the vehicle. It's going to disappear. That's the only way you can take it back into the arena or any garage for that matter. And then you just want to walk into your arena workshop. The car will be in there. And I suggest that you guys drive the vehicle back outside and drive it back inside so all of the noted... Blah, 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 blah. So all of the modifications save, not the notifications, but all of the modifications will save once you guys drive this vehicle back outside and back into your arena workshop. But that's pretty much it for this glitch, you guys. 100% solo. Don't forget we now have membership available on the channel, so join up, hit that blue button, become a part of the loyalist. You can get access to little perks like joining me in private parties, getting cars from me personally, asking me any questions you want, things like that. Uh, the packages range from... $4.99 to $5.99 to $9.99 and um, just make sure you guys go check that out and as always I'm trying to get this channel to 100,000 subscribers so please help me help you you guys and keep bringing you these great GTA 5 online videos until next time this is your boy Glitch Guru officially you peace stay loyal